We've been staring down this deadline for weeks for many with nervous anticipation. Friday, 5 p.m., the official deadline for all New York City municipal workers to get vaccinated or else. That or else means losing their job and just as importantly, their paycheck. Everybody should have freedom to choose what they do with their own body. And I'll never back down and I'll never take that poisonous shot. To be sure, opposition to Mayor Bill de Blasio's vaccine mandate with no testing option cuts across racial lines and professions. But of all of the city positions affected by the mandate, the fate of first responders is, not surprisingly, receiving the most scrutiny. Hundreds, perhaps thousands of sanitation workers, police officers and firefighters have protested throughout the week. The big question, will emergency response times suffer come Monday morning, the result of widespread sick outs and other mandate related absences? The mayor predicts money will dramatically increase vaccination rates over this coming weekend. We expected that a lot of the vaccinations would happen toward the end of the deadline. Uh, we also know a lot of people make the decision once they really realize that they're not going to get paid. FDNY Lieutenant James McCarthy, who is also president of the Uniformed Fire Officers Association, would not predict whether the mandate will affect attendance come Monday. We were exposed to COVID before there were masks, before there was testing, before there was a vaccine. But McCarthy says his union members simply want the de Blasio administration to acknowledge the presence of COVID antibodies as a substitute for proof of vaccination. They do have immunity. They're not going to get sick again. They're not going to... Uh, transmit the virus to anybody else in the public. Stanford University just did a recent study and brought it out there that the antibody level is equal to or uh, very close to the antibody level you get with the vaccines. So we need to recognize that.